All right, I'm just gonna say it. I absolutely hate it when enemies have too much health. I'm not talking about bosses with a bigger health bar or your standard tough giant enemy types. I'm talking about enemies with so much health that you get tired of the fight even when you're winning it. This is typically something that occurs in genres like looter shooters, RPGs, action games, and a lot of games with those really annoying hard difficulty settings. Again, I'm not saying it's bad for bosses or tough enemies to have more health or be beefier, but I am saying there needs to be a balance between a difficult boss fight and one that I can sit down and watch an entire episode of The Office while I'm fighting it. These health bars simply prolong an already easy or uninteresting fight, making them frustrating or even annoying rather than engaging. If the boss isn't fun or challenging with less health, the only thing that adding more health will do is draw out the fight, drain player resources like potions or ammunition, and annoy the hell out of them. And I know you all know what I'm talking about. These are the enemies that you will just spam the same critical hit attacks over and over and over and over again. And then eventually, you do need to heal because you will take damage at some point. Ya boy did some math on this one. In Tales of Arise, there was an enemy I fought where a sword hit from Alfin, the main character, was inflicting approximately 0.00016% of the enemy's total health pool. An attack that was critical against the enemy's type was dealing 0.001% of damage to the enemy's health. So what you're telling me is I need to hit this thing combined with my party over a thousand times. It was not a hard fight. Other than in the second half, its damage output was one hitting some of my party members. Sure, I could grind and get to a higher level and come back. But I have two really good reasons for me to not do that. Number one, I really don't want to do it. And number two, the fight will not be any more interesting when I come back that second time. It will either still be a grind, or I will be a much higher level and the fight won't be a challenge. Too high damage output plus too much health is a deadly combo. And not for my characters in the game, but for my enjoyment of the game. Now listen, even the characters are sick of this shit. Blah, 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 magic. I have seen this issue in a lot of games, ranging anywhere from Destiny to Assassin's Creed to Astral Chain. In a title with Assassin in the name, I can't even assassinate people anymore unless I level up my stats. I want games to challenge me in new and interesting ways, rather than just padding an enemy's health and making me dread every time I get into a fight. We're gonna fight that? We have no choice. So, to balance out a reduction in health, what can these fights change? Well, the enemy can have multiple phases. This can break up the enemy's health bar, mix up the gameplay while maintaining the length of the fight, and also allow the player to actually feel progress in the fight. Additionally, the enemy could only be attackable at certain points of the fight. See many Zelda, Mario, and countless other games that have done this with their bosses. This could also allow for the player to seize opportunities when the enemy is on the offensive to create additional attack periods. The enemy could also have more variety in its attacks, making the fight more difficult without increasing the amount of damage or health, but by making it more difficult to read what its next move will be. This can also have additional benefits in other areas as well. The player will feel more powerful, and each attack will have more of an impact. Combat encounters will become much more approachable, XP will be rewarded at a much steadier rate, and the overall pacing of the game will feel much more smooth. I also understand that increasing health to artificially increase difficulty is often the cheapest option for devs, but without that increase, the game would be much less of a grind. If the bosses are lengthy with too much health, of course they will eventually wear down your character or party. At the same time, they're wearing down my will to live while I'm playing this freaking game. All right, anyway, thanks for watching. I felt like I needed to get that one off my chest after finishing Tales of Arise. Please like and subscribe if you enjoy this type of video, and let me know if there's an enemy in a game you felt had too much health in the comments below. In my next video, I'm going to discuss what actually makes a good boss fight. But until then, hope you have a great day, God bless my dudes, 
and bye. Just like that, I'm back in it.